Hey there everyone and welcome to a, another video on the channel. Today we are back on, wait, let me just make this full screen, and today we are on delusional artists. So before this video starts, none of this content on here is mine, I'm just purely showing off the content, I shall give credit to everybody, um, every single one of these things uh, today in today's video, so we're going to sort it by the top for the last week and then we're going to scroll down so one two three four six seven eight nine ten we'll just scroll down a little bit this might be a little bit jittery i do apologize um we'll scroll down to here so here we oh, this is 31. Never mind. so we've got mattress springs here by all my Fish are dying. Strange name, but fair enough. And they posted a mattress springs thing. Um, I'm not going to click full image, but I'm, I'm not sure what you're trying to show. But I wouldn't say that was art. So yeah, I think delusion artist is like where they think it's art. But it's not art, and it's not very nice to look at, or something like that. So here we have a post by Scrump Pit Boy underscore Boy. There you go. And this is a one million dollar piece of art. There we go. Brilliant. Doesn't that look lovely? I don't really have anything to comment. Um, it doesn't look very good. It looks like something that's been drawn by Scribble IO. Um, a big fish in a little pond. There's the fish. There's the pond. Yeah, I'm not even... People will understand what this picture is supposed to be showing. Think of this as a person, and this as a person. Yeah, definitely deleting on artisting there. Okay, so now we have a post by this person here. And Anne Fren. Sorry if I uh, didn't get your name very right. Right there. So this person should be working for what's it? Yeah, this is a very, 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 very good drawing. Um, so I'm going to have that because it's not very delusional, is it? I think. I don't know. I think I might get, be getting the wrong idea of this thing. But this is, this is very good. I like this. They're supposed to be bad artists. But look. But they can also do things where it's okay art, but they just charge too much for it. So maybe that's the case there. I'd pay $25 for that. I've seen people do like a drawing of like someone's face and it'd be like quite basic and then they charge like 15,000 for it on, on that subreddit. Can you see this? Yeah. Would you pay $25 for that? No. I would. It'd be so cool. Yeah, but like art is subjective so different, thing, different people think different uh, things about it. Okay, so Morgan doesn't like this. And, well, she likes it, but she wouldn't pay $25 for it. So in the comments down below, tell me if you would pay $25 for this. I personally would. Um, but yeah, next we have some abstract art uh, posted by Ames-X. There you go. Leave it on the screen for a bit. And it looks like something that, honestly, you could probably found in a museum for worth even more than this. So, I wouldn't pay 200 for it, and I could do this myself, but you do see stuff like this in, in museums, which sort of goes me on to a rant, a rant, which um, I kind of have all the time when I look at art. Like, I could do this, but if I sold it, I couldn't sell it for 200 or 200,000 or something, but other people can. So, how does that work? So, technically this is art, technically this is nice, and other people do like it, but... Personally, I just think it's you using a paintbrush and just splashing stuff at a page. Okay, next we have a post by you wake up that. I don't know, I don't know how to say that. Um, and here we have Godzilla against a dragon. Personally, if this is a kid, a child who has made this, Oh, high price. Ah. Yeah, I wouldn't... I'm not clicking on these. I'm supposed to be clicking on them, aren't I? $20,000. Yeah. 
for this. Yeah. Well, that's bad. That's that's really bad. Uh, next we have again too high of a price, but people would probably pay that much for it. And that was posted by Historian Slayer. He's got a B movie picture, that's kinda cool. That's really cool. Um but yeah, people do spend that much money on this kind of stuff as well. So although it's high priced, people would probably pay for that that much. Uh, bad art. Oh yeah, we got some melting shoes. Oh god, look how expensive that is. <laughs> oh, posted by this guy here. I'm not even going to try and pronounce that name, but credit to him for posting it. Next we have some shot glasses. Not food grade, please not do not drink from them. But they are super cute. Seven pound. So what's the point in buying a shot glass if... Yeah, look. What are you going to do? Put them on a shelf. And that was posted by Kobolds. So credit to him. But why would you buy this? Especially for £7. And you can't... You can't... Do anything with it. So, yeah. Next we have a post from... It's... 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 It's, it's happy. So kind of like that. Um, I don't understand this. Understand this? I don't, I don't. I don't understand. So I'm just gonna go off. To be honest with you, I don't understand it. Okay, well, a hundred down for you. <laughs> so the girlfriend or something has sat down, and then you can pay a hundred dollars to have her bum imprint. That's brilliant. <laughs> it's still that is disgusting. Why could it? On your fucking sorry, on your effing wall. No. That is point. disgusting. Okay. Next, we have a post from Scrumpip underscore boy. Well, Morgan definitely didn't like this. I, I, I didn't like it. I'm just saying that someone would probably pay for this. Yeah, you're right. Someone would probably buy that. Um, okay, sorry for that little cut. Um, the hamster wanted to go in his ball. Okay, so here we have some very expensive art. A little expensive, but hey, I pay that. Look at the shipping price. Oh, Jesus. 1.5. Whoa, that's not even. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money for shipping. I don't know if you can even see that. But it's one that's where my mouse is. Wow. Anyway, next we have... That looks like a Bob Ross painting. I need to upload that one. Check. Check. I went to high school with... Thanks for painting her. I'll find a post by this person. Um, personally, I wouldn't pay $500 for that, but it does look quite cool. But that's all I have to say about it. Um, I'm going to just gonna skip these because I don't really understand them. Rick and Morty. Bug Life. Rick and Morty paintings. Again, too much money. Too much money. I, don't, I haven't watched Rick and Morty. Yes, I should, but hey-ho. Uh, next we have this. Um, I used to watch this TV show when I was little. But um, how much is it? Should we see how much it is? Oh, it doesn't say a price. Oh, 200 for the set. No, thank you. Delusional artist. Um, next we have this furniture. So I've actually built a cabinet quite similar to this. In real life, and uh, this this is rubbish. Like, why? Why? Next, we have an alien drinking wine. So, if you're into aliens drinking wine, hmm, 
Seventy dollars shipped. Don't know. Would you pay that much if you're really obsessed with aliens? Probably. Who knows? Um, next we have a two hundred and seventy-five for a bunch of old ties that have been touched by someone's dirty feet. Interesting. Posted by this person. And I'm skipping them, but credit to everybody in these videos that have um, posted and I'm showing off your uh, post. Um, wait, that's Photoshop. Look, because it's like feet are like inside the ties. Like this doesn't exist in the real photo. And yeah, that was the top from the last month apparently. Or uh, last week actually. But anyway, that's going to do it for Delusional Artists. Some very, very interesting uh, photos actually because some of them are quite good like this is really good obviously I didn't show it off but it's too expensive like that's a very good photo but you wouldn't you just wouldn't you wouldn't pay that much and like that one that was all the way back at the bottom it was a very good bit of art you just wouldn't pay that much for it but anyway that's going to do it for today's video here I hope you guys did enjoy and uh, yeah if you guys do have any opinions on any of these pieces of art please do tell me in the comments down below I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye. Look, see, I remember when I met you as a sophomore. Started out as friends, but I knew that we would want more. Hit your favorite restaurant with your favorite dress on. That's one of my favorite memories.